I mean, we've talked obviously in the AFL about Thilthorpe, but what did, what were your thoughts on Thilthorpe returning in the SNFL and how he played? I thought he did enough just to sort of get some touch back. Oh, look, he's it, and he's he's bulked up a fair bit. So I think we're all going to wait and see how he goes at S, at AFL level. It'll mm-hmm. be interesting whether they and the way it sounds like you'll play another SNFL game. I, I yeah, not sure on that one. Mm-hmm. As long as he doesn't play the week after, because they play Nord the week <laughs> after. So, yeah. <laughs> Maybe two in and... Yeah, that, that'll that do. Is, that's that'll, enough. Yep, yeah, fair enough. enough. Uh, you're right about him, his bulk bulk size. Oh. He played it down in an interview after the game, saying, oh, I've only put on about three or four kilo. He doesn't look that way. He looks like he's put on a good seven or eight kilo. It's probably just more... It, 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 again, it mightn't be as much as that, but he's just now got the right bat. He looks better yep. structurally, yes. almost, you know, in terms yep. of looks the right yep. thing and... Yeah, so he, I think every every footy sport is waiting to see how he goes. Yep. So, Do yeah. Glenelg worry, though, really in the scheme of things? Well, it, it was also a loss, that, and it hurt their percentage. And mm. look, percentage may well decide decided in the Where SNFL everybody this, sits. Yep. this year. So it was, it was a big result for Glenelg. So wait and see. Uh, obviously, Adelaide getting up over the line there. Central District's getting up over Port Adelaide. Yeah, did the job. While it was close first half, just too good, too um, just too much depth compared mm-hmm. to the young Port side with their injuries and yep. then falling away. You know, yeah, they, they do lack depth, Port. It's a worry and we, we'll cover that, I think, as the season goes on because they've got some hard decisions to make as well, not only mm. at the AFL level but also at the SNFL level as well. Uh, Sturt doing the job over West Adelaide, I think predictable in the yeah, end. it was, yeah. Did the job continue to be around the mark, Sturt? No doubt about that whatsoever. Yep. There is a bit of a gap at the SNFL uh, with the better side. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it was predictive. Yep. Uh, the surprise for me, North Adelaide getting up over Woodville West Torrens. 